Hey, this is Charlie, and today I'm gonna flash a ROM. Um, right now I'm running the Wicked ROM on there. It's a really, pretty, pretty good and stable ROM. I've been running it now for about a, about, a, uh, about a three or four days I've been running that ROM. So what I'm gonna do now is really just show you how quick and easy it is to flash a ROM. First of all, you have to have a rooted device, and by now, if you look into flash ROM, you should, you should know that. So the first thing you wanna do is to boot your phone off. So we're gonna press boot and we're gonna power off, power off the phone. So now that the phone is completely off, you want to hold the power, the power button, the home button, and the up button up there, and you're gonna do it at the same time. And when you see the first blue light, the first blue line of writing appear, you're just gonna let it go, and that should take you into right here and you let it go and you're gonna be you're gonna boot into recovery mode from there and there you are so right here you boot into recovery mode and you're gonna go down and you're gonna start start um wiping the phone clean for the new install so i'm gonna i'm gonna wipe my factory data reset clean to install new boot and I'm, and I'm using my um, my power key my volume key to go up and down on my power key or I can use that bottom line I can use down here also to do the same thing so it's formatting the drive it's wiping the system and press any key to continue and it's gonna go back and you're gonna wipe your cache also and you're gonna go down and say yes and continue and and, and basically most times because i flash rom so much that's all i usually um i'm white um if you want you can go into advance and wipe your delvic cache also depending on on on, on um what rom that you that you um you're installing it will it's normally included so it'll wipe for you now i'm going to go to i'm going to install um the rom so i'm going to go into um install zip and i'm going to go to my storage sd card and i'm going to go and choose which one I want to run and, and right here they have, have a number of different ones I have the S5 ROM on there I have the the DAP Stalker on there I'm saying right the Jedi Elite um the stock um also have Wicked ROM on there and I have a bunch of different ROMs on there but I'm gonna try the so we're gonna go ahead and, and install the Jedi ROM Let's open the package. And so that's it, Jedi ROM version 6, March 2004 for the Samsung Galaxy 3. And you're going to agree with the terms and condition. And it's going to ask you do you want a full wipe or whatever. And we, we've already done that. Let's just go ahead and do the full wipe and let it do it. And it's gonna ask you what do you want the things that do you want to install. So I'm gonna put you can choose a number of things. I'm gonna choose Chrome, Hangout, um, no mobile pin, music player, whatever that is, Mile 5, Samsung Hub, no, S Voice, no, TV, no, Visual Voicemail, Stock Widgets. No, I'm gonna install Kyle's mobile print. Um, next, add free audio keyboard. Next, we um, next and install. 
and it's gonna do its installation and we'll come back when it's done okay so we're ready for the full installation it did all its stuff and now we're gonna click install and and it's gonna ask well it did the installation and now now we're gonna ask you to reboot and we're gonna click yes and it's rebooting and it's gonna reboot like the phone is rebooting for the first time after you buy it and you're gonna have to walk through the process of you know putting in all your new stuff all your stuff all your information for your Wi-Fi and all that stuff Um, that first and the first on the first boot up it, it might take a little while so be uh, be be patient so here we have the first boot on the in the process and you're gonna click next and it's gonna look for Wi-Fi so you're gonna turn your Wi-Fi on and click next and we're gonna skip that and you're just gonna put in your information until you get to where you need to go click next your google account yes and then you're gonna put in your and that's where all your backup and everything gonna be placed in there so everything's gonna be restored and you're just gonna rock for the process Give your phone a name. Really, that's it. You're done, and you can start using your ROM. And everything is ready to be used. Everything is in there. Everything works so far, and you're ready to go. That's how simple it is to put your ROM on there. This is Charlie. I'm out.